My name is Vic Llewellyn. Um, I'm predominantly an actor, although I do direct shows and, um, and facilitate workshops. I was kindly asked uh, by Bertel to uh, facilitate the day. It's, um, it's uh, quite a unique experience um, that's, that's happening here. We've got 12 actors all doing short pieces of theatre, mostly self-written, uh, mostly self-directed. <laughs> reason uh, is to give actors chance yeah, to yeah, try things action. that they don't usually do, um, to maybe try pieces of uh, character work that they might not, not generally get asked to do uh, for whatever reasons. Um, it's a chance to uh, try new things out in front of a live audience. Oh, fuck it! And what's particularly interesting about that experience is that the audience get the chance to directly feed back uh, their experience of the evening. It offers a lot of variety, the 10 by 3 events, and we're very excited to be part of it. Yes. Uh, doing a short scene, which is part of a longer play, but it works in isolation, so it's uh, nice to be part of it. And as I say, it's an exciting event, which offers diversity to the audience. Hi, my name's David Bailey. Um, I was at the first 10 by 3 uh, back in June of this year. And I'm really pleased to be back again. It really is a great night. You two, sat nav, you never had any of that in your day, did you, Dad? No, I say we bloody didn't. That's why my generation invented all that stuff. Um, I've actually written a three-minute piece, uh, which I'll be performing as well. And I find that a real challenge, you know, to get, to get um, the essence of a character in just three minutes and hopefully perform it reasonably proficiently so it's uh, the message gets across to the audience it really is great i am going to do something worthwhile with my life and i'm going to do it right tomorrow <laughs> i think scratch nights are great because they allow performers a chance to get their teeth into something which is going to be seen at the scratch night i.e probably quite soon and um uh, uh, so that's keeping us on our toes and able to, to work with stuff and, and have an end goal. I think it's the challenge, you know, if you think at 10 o'clock this morning, um, you've got a group of actors who each came with their own thoughts and their own pieces, and by 8 o'clock this evening, there's a show that's been rehearsed um, three times, and uh, now here it is for the first time, and probably for one, one night only ever, here it is before a live audience, and uh, it's an exciting concept. Yeah.